Good day there everybody, Ozzy here once again. Today I'm going to do a tier list on all the shiny Pokemon from the Paldean region. These are Paldean Pokemon, and this is on the eve of the Indigo Disc. So, this is how I feel about all the shinies from all the new Pokemon we've got so far. So, let us begin. Right, I'm going to be honest, some will get explanations and some won't. Like, Maridon, you look really cool in silver, and I really love it, so you're an A tier. You, I'm not a fan of. Dippin, my man. That's definitely AT shiny, because I love them. Now, Ogapon, this is where I mean I'll give some explanation and some won't. Your face stays green. You look really cool in your fire mode. Other than that, no. And, like, a lot of these Paradox Pokemon from the future just kind of look, look, you're a teacup and you have a little bit on the rim, and you're greener. And they just look like they've been hit with um, a bit of sandblast and they lost all their colour. And it just doesn't really suit them all. Like, Maridon looks cool, but a lot of them don't. You and you are S-tier Pokemon for Shinies. I mean, Chaiyu and Ching Pao. That, that, uh, these guys are absolutely fantastic. And I'm going to go out on a limb and say Mikoridon. These three are one of my favorite Shinies and um, cannot wait until they're unlocked so we can actually get the Shiny version because they look absolutely fantastic. And that's how you do a Shiny. I don't understand why we've got crap like this. Like you, you eat, you barely do anything changes, and you're one of the most frustrating things to try and capture, a shiny. Same with all the Tauruses. I'm just going to put them up there right now. They just go from their normal black to a matte black. It's very hard to tell them apart, not much changes. So they're going in an E-class well because they just, just does not do it for me. All right. Now, remember, this is my personal opinion. So... If you got a different opinion, let me know. Um, actually, as much as I hate the Loyal 3, and I mean I really hate the Loyal 3, these guys have really good shinies. You are just a slightly grey version. Now, my snail, Wo Chin, you are an AT Pokemon. You go from green to autumn. Bax Calibur, no. See, not much changes with you, bruv. Iron Bundle, yeah, same with you. You just go silver. Same with, like... You know, a lot of the Paradox, they just, you know, Iron Thorns just becomes more mecha-looking than Godzilla. You just lose your paint. But with saying that, I'm going to put a lot of those there. Iron Hands, that's A. And the main reason I put him in A is because when he comes out, he looks like a shiny set of testicles, and it makes me laugh every time I see him. You ever come to a live stream and I let him loose? I go, look, it's a shiny set of testicles because it makes me giggle. Blood Moon Ursaluna, you become my Velveteen dream, bro. You go Velvet, B. Rory Moon, look, as much as he does look different, I feel like they could have went with a better colour because I'm not a fan of that colour green. Sandy Shocks, yeah, I like the gold, I'll be honest. You're not in this tier, but you're pretty cool. Fluttermane, same with you. You're a B tier shiny, but you're really cool, the easy to spot. But I'm just not a fan of the green colour, to be honest. Now, this list here... Is not where they position in the A, like obviously I'd move it around, but this is how I feel like I rank them in this their categories. Slither main. What what I do? I put him there. I'm gonna put him in A because I like the the yellow wings and he looks real cool. He looks like a Volcarana and he just karate chops everyone. Scream tail. You're a D man. Very little changes. Bl brute bonnet. Um B, because at least you can really tell. King Gambit. I'm going to put you in A because you're really different to the other one. Bags light, you get a different slide of blue, you're alright. I'm going to put you in C. You, my little sushi friend, are absolutely horrible to shiny hunt. And I'm going to be honest, this is my opinion, but to try and hunt for their shinies, is like, the shinies look like the other versions of them. So it makes it incredibly difficult to get. And they can just stay down and eat, and I hate their mouse hold, you can get your ass down there too. Because you're just crap tackle if I'm going to be honest with you. Same as Quark and Billy. I'm not a fan of him either. Alright, so that's basically why I put those three being like, oh, his shirt changes. Doesn't matter if he's a three or a four family of mouse. Fucking awful. Saizla. Saizla. Like, you're different, but I feel like you could add a cooler colour. Great tusk. Same reason as Fluttermate. He looks completely different, but I feel like 
They could have gave him some cooler colours. You go from purple to green, um, purple to green, which does stand out. But I feel like they could have done more. So Titan, that's how you do a shiny, everyone. I'm gonna be honest. He goes from a white behemoth to a black grey one, and it's totally different. It's the opposite colours, and he looks fucking fantastic. Gimora, the main Pokemon of the worst champion ever. B, you're pretty cool. Bendoza, A. I love it. I love his color scheme. Bombardier, you just get black beak and black feet. Houndstone. While it's only a subtle change, I do make it feel like he makes him look even better. Like, I love it. Same with you, Lady Gaga, or F. Banana. A. I mean, you look fucking fantastic. Earthworm. Yeah, I like the metallic blue look. I really do. I'm going to go with Reverend. Reverend for me is definitely an AT. He goes from shiny to gold and it just really, really suits him as an engine. It makes him look like people who are putting in the time to give him some decent chrome, which I really do love. Alright, you, I love how you become a gold scarab. It looks cool. Bug Trio. Definitely A because at least you can really tell. Palafin. Hero form is S. Palafin. Just normal form. Yeah, I'll put it in A. I'm not sure if A or B. I'm going to put it in A because at least you can actually tell it's a shiny. That that colour there should have been on him because it would keep him. You are one of the worst Pokemon I've ever had experience running into, bud. I mean, I can't believe that's the first grass shiny. Um, first grass fire. And I just don't understand it. Scovillian. I mean, I get what I'll go on. You're a pepper. Caps can you know, where I'm from, but nah, bruv. They could, you could have done a lot better than that. You're just slightly different, but you do. I do like you. He does look cool. Ruffy, uh, you're a tumbleweed, and you get little bits of color changes on your tips. See, think a ton. I'm gonna go B for you. I mean, I know it's hammer that changes the weapon, but I feel like they could have done a little bit more. Rough. This is actually the first Pokemon I caught in my Terror Raids. And when I threw the Pokemon, I thought something was up, so I went and checked in the box. And my word, that was a shiny Pokemon. So, I'm going to go and put him in the A class. Fourth. Yeah, A. I like the blue. I haven't got him yet, but I love him. You. And you. What the fuck were they thinking? I mean, they could have had Cellularge become armor urges color and vice versa but instead they get a different color eyes which is just an absolute letdown post school cruel hey i love it he's cool as a subspecies of tentacruel he's really really cool my boston you go from you just don't get a stuck color and you do look more better but i'm gonna put you in b just because i feel like they could have done a little bit more you're just an olive tree and your olives are black Annihilate, look, as much as I love this Pokemon, he's one of my favorite Pokemon now of all time. Basically not much else changes, and I feel like they could have done a lot cooler. D, the, uh, the Dunsparth, the Pokemon that Pokemon Company trolled everyone with. Everyone thought it was evolution was going to be something cool, but it's it's not. I'm going to put him in A just because of that. Cyclops, C, I mean you're different. You see, because you're just a slightly burnt dash bun. Yes. Yeah, I'll go with that. I will admit, though, I got a um, wiglet the other day. I was, like, hunting, and I found him, and I was like, oh, shit, he's gold, and he looked really cool. That is an A-type. I love how the original ones are black, and then when you find a catch, you get a little pink pig, which is really, really cool. Blankoline, I love you. Now this right here for me is another A-type Pokemon. I mean, Palmot, he's like an orangey brownie kind of color, but I just really love the pink on him and it makes him look more, more like one of those animals where you go, oh, it's cute and cuddly and then he just punches in the face because, you know, he's a fighting electric type, which is really cool. Killer Wattrell. He has slightly different colored wings. You're a pain in the ass to catch. Belly Bolt. I'm gonna put you in B because I'm not a fan of your colour. Low kick. I'm gonna put you in B as well for the same reason. 
Yeah, I can make cool. Hey. Now remember, this is my personal opinion. So you gotta let me know in the comments where you'd move and run. Right? Because some I feel I feel like others will love these differently. Now to the starters and look. I'm gonna be honest, I do not like the Paldean starters. I feel like they're absolute garbage to be honest. I feel like they're way too over designed. Masquerade is probably my favourite. But in saying that, like, it's it shiny is not that much different. And like, I, I get it that it's normal, it's red and it's kind of pink. But they could have done something else. Same with you, mate. Like, Paxival. Like, I just feel like he's just this different shade of blue. And he's gone lighter. And I just feel like they could have done so much more and had better starter Pokemon than what they had. But anyway... That's my where I put all the shinies from Paldea at the moment. This is only their final forms because if I went first form and second form, this video would probably be an hour long and I'd probably mess up more, a lot more names than what I have. But anyway, this is on the eve of the Indigo Disc too, everybody. So tomorrow we'll have even more Pokemon to add to it. So let me know what you change in your list, where you'd move everyone. Blood Moon Saluna, thank Christ you're not that god awful orange, um, green that. You know your predecessors had. You're a Velveteen Dream now. But anyway, I've been Neil Ziana. Let me know down below where you'd put everyone. And as always, get ready because Indigo Disc is coming, everyone. And we're going to the Blueberry Academy. So hopefully I'll see you there. Come join me in a live stream and we can battle Pokemon together. And as always, I've been Neil Ziana. G'day. And until next time, happy hunting. <laughs>